All right, a perfect way to lead into our story number nine. We are in Rancho Cucamonga for this week's SoCal Spotlight. And KCAL Shiva Turk joins us live from Coffee House celebrating its 30th anniversary all weekend long. And Shiba, there's so much to learn about coffee. It's, it's so interesting. They re there's really so much to learn, Chris, because we're taking it all the way from the beginning here. We're at Clatch Coffee Roastery, where they take us from the beans to the drinkable version. We spoke with Mike Perry earlier, the owner. Heather Perry, his daughter, is joining us now to show off some of the drinks. Yes, so I'm showing off the drinks that we're going to be serving this weekend. One of the things we love to do at Clatch is create new drinks. So I'm starting right here with our Mother of Pearl drink. Now, I know you're not a big coffee drinker, but to yeah. give you an example, we're going to do a spritz of orange in here. Smell inside Ooh. that cup. Smells amazing. Exactly. So it's not just about the coffee. I mean, it's obviously about the coffee, but we love <laughs> creating fun drinks here. So we've got a beautiful orange syrup here. And of course, we've got to make it look beautiful as it tastes as well. Oh, it does look beautiful. Drinks. Yes. So we're going to be serving our mother of pearl this weekend. We've also got this watermelon cold burrito. No alcohol in here, but lime juice, watermelon, our delicious cold brew, our WC Nitro, actually. Oh These are so creative. And I want to make clear, we yeah. spoke to your dad earlier about the roastery and how you guys take it from the process of the beans to this. Yep. And then you have seven locations where people can actually buy the coffee. This is not one of them. This is not one of them, but we've got all, I mean, they're our first one, 30 years we've been in the one just down the street from here, here in Rancho. That's really amazing. Yeah. Yeah. I was telling us you've been helping him out since you were a little kid. Honestly, I've been helping him out since I was 10. My daughter has been cupping coffee since she was wow. like two or three. Yeah, it's absolutely, it runs in the blood. <laughs> okay, so what else are we making to celebrate this 30th yeah, anniversary? We're kicking off, come on in, Luis. We are kicking off National Coffee Day with coffee and cocktails tonight. So, Luis, tell us what you're putting in the picture. We're going to yes. make a clash Mai Tai. To awesome. kick off our happy hour tonight, we're going to be making a cold brew cocktail, which has orgeat syrup, lime juice, mm -hmm. peach liqueur, orange liqueur, okay. and some dark brandy. Okay, so no one's gonna be standing after this one. Absolutely not. Can people join in the celebration? Do they have to get tickets? Absolutely. So we've got tickets on sale. You can buy tickets at the door. It kicks off tonight with our happy hour, 4.30. Tomorrow, you've heard of a wine walk. So we're doing a coffee crawl here. So all seven of our locations are going to be here making, serving drinks that they've come up with within the store. We don't serve any of these drinks in our store. So the only way to get these is come party with us this weekend that here at the roastery. So cool. Where can people get tickets? Clatchcoffee.com. Mm -hmm. um, we've got tickets for everything on sale. And if you want the ultimate pearl experience on Sunday, um, you get access to all three days. Nice. Okay, Louise, what you doing now? And the best part about this drink is our homemade coffee liqueur layered right on top. These are so beautiful. Hope to see you guys there. We love it. All right, what does it feel like seeing what your parents' idea has come to? Honestly, I, it's one of those things where my dad and I talk about it. I don't think either one of us ever envisioned being where we are today. You yeah, know what I mean? We're opening yeah. a brand new roastery down the street, which is 16,000 square foot. And it's just, it's crazy. We're very blessed to be supported by such a great community, a coffee community, the community of Rancho for the last 30 years. It's really been great. Well, Heather, this is so special. Thanks for taking us behind the scenes. And Louise, thanks for these amazing drinks. I'm going to send it back over to you, Chris. All right, Shiba. Yeah, so many different types of drinks. I had no idea. But we saw behind you, there was all these awards. <laughs> which one are they most proud of, really quick? Oh, yeah, I'm so glad that you asked. They are definitely most proud of this one. I'll let Heather explain. What's your best award? So this is our WBC blend, and I actually got the award for World's Best Espresso in 2007 at oh. the World Barista Championships. It's well, the only year it was ever given, so we're very proud of this. Chris, I am among world champs today. Okay. Hey, you are a world champ, and bring back one of those coffee cocktails, and uh, we'll have a drink after work. Just kidding. I got it, friend. Just I'll kidding. I know you don't like coffee, but hey, great job today.